Hey and welcome back to episode 63 of my Hardcore Iron Man. Uh, I'm sorry I haven't released a video in a while. Uh, I've had loads going on with work and also my internet's been playing up which has been amazing. Uh, but last episode we was doing loads of the achievement diaries and managed to get quite a few knocked out and got a few lamps from that but also got a stupid amount of lamps from handing in all the fossils. Now I want to do some questing so let's go on with that. Finally completed Forsaken Tower. I can't remember what the quest was, so I looked at the achievement diaries and told me which one it was. Um, so we got some coins, XP, and the page, which is what I mostly wanted. So I could do the achievement diaries in the Krenk Bus. So I think, yeah, I can do the easy medium. Can't do the hard because I haven't got 70 smithing, and I still need to go do Dream Mentor. I might go do that soon. So finally completed the Lumbridge Hard Diaries, we'll upgrade the ring into number 3. Uh, this is really good because now I've got limited teleports to the farm patch just outside of Falador. Uh, I can get 50% run energy 4 times a day, 10% um, increased tiers from, what was it, XP? From tiers of Girl Fix. I can't remember, it's something like that. And also the reward lamp, which is going to put me really close to another runecrafting level, so... Oh, that's, that's looking loads better now. Um, I don't know if I can do any more diaries. Well, I say that. I can do uh, this one and this one, but I don't know if I'm going to do it yet. Finally done contact. It was a scary quest because uh, of the multi-zone area, because they all gang up on you, but to be fair... Uh, with these stats, it wasn't too bad to do it. I barely any food, really. Uh, but we get a bit of XP. We're coming up on 250 quest points. But the most important thing is I get access to the local bank when I start doing Pyramid Plunder. Uh, let's see, what can we stick this in? Um, probably just stick it all in magic, I think, because all the other skills are easy to train. Well, so is magic, but it just saves a little bit of time. So, Woo, that was a, that was a good quest to do. There we go, Mountain Daughter is now done. Another two quest points, tiny little bit of XP. And I'm gonna have a quick look. What on earth am I doing at the quest? Because there's not many left now, so I'm gonna try and smash out a few more of these, I think. The audio on this clip was really messed up. There's like a ton of static, but uh, the most important thing was, was uh, we completed the Slug Menace quest and also got Runecraft in level, which is really nice. I love getting Runecraft levels. And also I was on about buying some armor or something. I don't know, the static was pretty bad. We'll see in the next clip. So just spent 25k and upgraded from the old initiate to the proselyte and it increases... Uh, I keep clicking the wrong thing. There we go. Increases our prayer to uh, plus 18 now, so I'm not going to drain my prayer as fast now, so I should have done that ages ago. There we go. Dream Mentor is done. I was a little bit scared about doing this one. I watched uh, some music do it, and he pretty much used all of his food. I ended up only eating one piece of food, so that was pretty good. Uh, but I need this to unlock more spells. Also, I don't always have to bring my seal of passage anymore. I can use the bank with the extra bank you get a decent amount of XP and also the lamp which I am going to stick that in to there we go um, probably just gonna stick it in magic yeah trained a lot of magic today without even doing magic it's great and there we have it my arms big adventure completed it wasn't too bad to do that quest um, got 10k herbal XP which is crazy uh, didn't realize I got that much 5k herb at uh, farming it's pretty nice as well I didn't realize that this was actually a disease free herb patch and we've now unlocked the little route of climbing up and down here and seeing oh I thought the uh, the dead dwarf was always her just uh, a broken glass now uh, poor dwarf Finally, 89 thieving coming in. Oh man, are my fingers hurting. Um, I was kind of close to the level I thought I'd get now. I mostly do thieving whilst watching TV and things like that on my laptop because it's just so easy to do. So I probably won't be seeing another thieving level for a while. Uh, this is such a nice quest. Scary as fuck, but 
Ah, what a nice quest. Uh, if you can't tell, I'm doing the newest troll quest line. Um, yeah, it's it's uh, it's been interesting to say the least. Oh, that was a scary boss battle. Um, I overate all the time, just trying to be uh, well prepared for that because it's a little bit scary. But um, yeah, making what was it? Uh, friend to my arm quest. Yeah, that one. Uh, it's done. Ah, oh, that was that was tense. A load of XP from that, and is it two hair patches? I don't know. I haven't even done this on my main yet, so yeah, I'm gonna go mine all the stuff that you mine at the mine thing. I have no idea, so this is this is all new to me. So let's go have a look. Any levels? Nah. So I'm just in the pits at the minute, mining all the rocks that I need to mine. Uh, I'm gonna work out how many of each I need and just probably mine all of them now, so I don't think it's going to take too long. About an hour later, I finally managed to mine all the salts I needed to go light all the braziers, so I'm probably going to go do that fairly soon after a couple of uh, daily runs. I meant to do this quest a while ago as well, but uh, Royal Trouble's done, so now I think I get another five workers. Um, Got some monies and some XP and some random stuff, so that's pretty good. Um, so let's just talk to this guy. Um, oh no, wrong thing. I ain't done this in so long. I can't even uh, remember what I'm doing now. So yeah, it's a bit awkward. Yeah, I'm. Just, yeah, we're done anyway. <laughs> there we go. That was the screen's trying to get to. I don't know why completely mess up so um, I think we're gonna be sticking mostly into herbs I don't even think I've touched this since the start um, I think that's how I'm gonna have it because I don't oh wait no I don't I don't want maples uh, let's get teaks and we'll stick it all on that I don't need any mining supplies or farming or fish so Lots of herbs and lots of teat logs, that'd be nice. So I'm going to end off the episode here. I've pretty much finished all my quests, I've only got a couple left, so I want to finish that off next time. Um, I've also pretty much caught up with the achievement diaries now, which I'm really pleased about. There's still a couple I need to go do, but I'm not too bothered about doing them yet. Um, but I'm gone back onto Slayer for a bit now, and I'm gonna try and stick at Slayer again for a bit. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Remember to subscribe, and I'll see you then. Cheers.